In this video, we'll balance the equation for Al plus S8 yields Al2 S3. Sometimes you'll see just Al plus S, but we have this octasulfur here. It's a good one to know how to balance. Teachers often ask this question. So let's count the atoms up and balance the equation. One aluminum, eight sulfur atoms, product side, two aluminums, three sulfur atoms. And we're immediately met with this kind of problem here, a three and an eight. How do we deal with that? Let's leave the aluminums to last because it's going to be easy to fix that. We'll just put something in front of the aluminum here and that'll be fixed. So this three and eight. What I'd like to do is find something that both of these numbers go into. The only thing I can think of is 24. Three times eight equals 24. So I'm going to put a coefficient of eight here. So three times eight, that'll give me 24. And then two times eight, that'll give me 16. So on the reactant side, now I could put a three here, eight times three, that would give me 24. And then the aluminum, we said that'll be easy to fix. I need 16, put a 16 in front and we're done. This equation is balanced. So the key here is if you get something odd like eight and three, sometimes it's useful to find a common number that they both go into and work from there. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for Al plus S8 yields Al2S3. Thanks for watching.